Hello everybody, it is Baron here today. I discovered I could do this voice, but I don't know why I would do it. It's just silly. <laughs> Before we get off, join our Discord. We've reached 500 people, and the more activity we get, well then, you know, we can partner with Discord, essentially. And I, I don't know, you know, it offers a few little perks here and there. But today we want to talk about Drake ships and whether or not what we can expect from Drake. And I apologize that I haven't been bringing out much content. I've been hooked, absolutely hooked on the new Call of Duty. I know it's pathetic, it's disgusting, it's a horrible game, but I love it. <laughs> um, so we want to talk about what we might be able to expect from Drake. Now we know Misk is bringing out like a, it's like a cargo, but a, like a, a, a crafting ship. I don't know. And this can be called the Drake Cutter. Um, people are, you know, theorizing that it could essentially be the Corsair. But if you looked at that image, if you looked at it, it doesn't look like a Corsair. You know what I mean? I can't really tell what part of it looks like the Corsair. Like, it, I mean, you would see the wings. It, 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 the shape of it just doesn't make sense at all. You've got these little flappy bits here. Now... One of two things. This could be the mysterious Misk ship that we've been hearing about, or this could be the Drake Cutter, the, which was found in the game files. Now, people were saying that that was the Vulture indeed, but again, the CEO of Drake is introducing a new ship, or just a ship in general, and they don't really do this too often. It could be straight to flyable, it could be a concept, but I'm, I am myself, I'm going to get it. I don't really care. So, as you can see, we've got the, like the blue, we've got the red, and we've got the steel, we've got the black. So, the Cutlass Black, obviously, Obviously, just like your all-round sort of cargo hauling, putting your vehicle in. Your blue, sort of like your bounty hunting ship. Red, medical ship, steel, um, troop carrier, Corsair, exploration, vulture, um, salvaging, herald, data running, buccaneer, fighter. And then you've got your dragonflies there. And then you've got your mule, mule, which is essentially like a forklift. You've got your Corsair, which again is a modular cargo hauler. And then you've got your two krakens. Yes, I know a little bit about drake ships. You can say that I do. I don't care. Um, but... What, you know, what is missing? What is missing that we may be able to expect? Is this a mining vehicle? But again, we've got an, an RSI mining vehicle coming up between the Orion and the Mule, or the Mole, sorry. So when you look at these two different manufacturers and you look at all these manufacturers and what they've been bringing out lately, what is it that we can expect? You know, is this some form of a, I don't know, can you crack through a hull with this thing it's got VTOL on it it looks like it's very I don't know it doesn't look like it could go very fast like it, these look like the main thrusters of some kind and then if you have a look here there looks like some sort of um, an exhaust system maybe another sort of thruster and then you got these two little wings at the back so it's <laughs> it's a very weird ship but again like there's so much information in this photo that I'm just not picking up um, I don't know if what you all think of this and what it could possibly be. The only thing we're really going to know is once that, you know, that next patch comes out for IAE and what that could really tell us. But again, like all the grounds are pretty much getting covered with Drake. And I know that we could see some form of another cargo hauler from them. Like it is lacking that sort of side. It could be a science vessel of some kind. You know, I did this before and we got the Legionnaire and my mind was blown. But again, the craft that I was theory theorizing as well was then another version of the Pisces, which is now that medical Pisces that we will see. Um, but again, this itself, it's just every time I see a Drake ship, I'm just like, what? What is it now? Like, what, what could it be? The Cutlass Steel was just an absolute plunder of a ship, and you, they want so much for for what it is. And people still bought it. Yeah, okay, people still bought it. I know people that are massive collectors, and they still got it. It's like, why? Why did you get it? But looking at manufacturers and like what different aspects of the game that they're covering right now, it just... I can't put together the pieces of what I could think that this is. And, like, again, like I said, it's very, very... Um, you know, it's not asymmetrical like the Corsair. Like, the Corsair is very different on one side, and then you've got a straight side on the other. It's all pretty much rounded the same and looks very same on, like, they're all around the ship, pretty much. Uh, where, you know, the Corsair, it's... When people were saying that it was the Corsair, I was like, it, it can't be, like... Yeah, it could have been, but, again, I don't think these thrusters are VTOL, and these wings just fold straight up. So, looking at that, it 
doesn't didn't really make too much sense to me sense to me sorry I mean yeah it could be it is it could be but like look at the thrusters on that compared to the Corsair and people are gonna say yeah well the Corsair's changed but again like the, the shape of the Corsair compared to that it just doesn't match like it just it does not match this could be a medical vessel again uh, but I don't think so since they already got one it man it's it could go in so many different directions I'm gonna sit here and I'm gonna think about it I'm gonna go through it you know being saying that it's a Drake cutter we know there's an Aegis cutter but could this be some form of a salvaging vehicle or a vehicle for the salvaging vehicle something like um, the Expanse but for salvaged material then refining that material and then getting more for it or could you take it to a refinery I don't I just don't know you would probably just have to sell the raw material since there's no real use for it as of yet but I guess we'll have to find out at IAE they did mention that we would may hear something about it before then or at the show when they do their live series and all their Star Citizen shows I don't know I just wanted to put this out there sort of get people talking about this and see what people could come out with because some of the stuff you guys digest it's just absolutely insane and I can't believe some of the stuff you guys talk about in the comments you may expect a little bit of an influx of people coming into the discord into the comments into the views it's all based around IAE yes the channel has just gone crazy at the moment so I'm sorry I try to get to your comments I really do I've always tried to make that my number one goal but it's just lately it's crazy the comments are coming in like crazy and I appreciate you all for your support and I love it I love you guys um but I hope you enjoyed I know I rambled on I do ramble a little bit but I just want to know I just want to like theorize I love theory crafting these ships and what it could be and what you guys pretty much come out with and tell me and you know, just the conversations we have. It's great. I love it. It's fantastic. This community is great. I love you guys. Hope you enjoyed. I'm sorry for rambling. It's been Baron. If you liked it, leave a like, comment, subscribe. If you didn't, leave a dislike, and I'll see you in the verse. Bye-bye, baby.